Hello everyone, here we are again for another session of Seller's Choice Tutorials. In this tutorial, we will learn how to create Amazon listing variations by size and by color. Most of the Amazon sellers sell products with a lot of variety. If you're a new seller on Amazon, there's a lot of things to know. One of this is selling products with variations, such as different colors and sizes. A variation relationship is a set of products that are related to one another. Variation allows buyers to customize product selection based on different attributes, including size and colors, or other characteristics from the available options on a single detail page. So let's get started. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Create Amazon listing variation by color. First, you need to sign into your Amazon Seller Central account. Hover your mouse to the Inventory tab and select the drop-down menu. Select Add a Product and you will be directed to the Add a Product page. Since this is going to be a new listing, let's click the Create a New Product Listing link. In the search field, type in the product category and click Find Category. Select the appropriate category in the Categories column. Type in the product name and let's go to Variations tab. We'll get back to the other missing field later on. Click the Variation tab and click the Variation Theme drop-down menu. Since this tutorial is for creating listing for size and color, let us select color first. Fill in the colors field with the color name you give the item, then click the Add Variation button. You will notice that it automatically arranged everything below. Let us fill out the fields. Fill in the color map. The difference between color and color map is that color is the color name you give the item. Color map is a what general color they are. So you might call the color navy, carolina, azure, or still winter lake, but they're all mapped to blue. Mine is emerald, which is mapped to green, and my second one is cherry, which is mapped to red. It is optional to fill out the SKU. It stands for Stock Keeping Unit. You don't need to get one, but it is a method sellers use to identify their products. It means nothing to Amazon, but if you have a system, it can be used to help you locate your product. Example, S1B3 could mean Shelf 1, Box 3. However, once you allocate an item, an SKU, it can be changed. If you don't give your item 1, Amazon will just generate a random one for you. Next is fill out the product ID and select the product ID type. This is where it gets tricky. First of all, Amazon requires a product ID to ensure there are no duplicate product pages. This can be UPC, EAN, GTIN, GCID, and ASIN. The details in getting a product ID will be explained in another tutorial. In general, you need to get your brand approved or you need to have your product registered so you will be provided with codes to use when listing. The easiest way would be to go through the brand registry. Fill out the item condition, standard price, and the quantity. And that is how you do variations by color. To create Amazon listing variation by size, let's edit this first and click continue to edit to refresh a tab. So in the variations tab, click the variation theme drop down menu and select size. Fill in the size field with how you name the size, then click the add variation button. You will notice that it automatically arranged everything below. So let us fill out the fields. Fill the size map. Again, this is the same with the color. 
you can name your size but in the size map you need to select the appropriate size associated with the product fill out the product id field select the product id type and the item condition fill out the price and the quantity and that is how you do variation by size now let's mix things up this time is on how to create Amazon listing variations by size and color. So again, let's edit this first and click continue Continue to edit to refresh the tab. So in the variation tab, click the variation theme drop down menu and select color size. You will see two groups, which are the color and the size. Fill out the colors and the sizes that it has in the other group then click the add variation button you will notice that it is arranged in a way that each color has its own size again fill out the color map size map product ID select the product ID type and the item condition then fill out the standard price and quantity now to complete your listing so you can post it we need to fill out the missing fields on the vital info tab and add the images in the offer tab check the box that says let me skip the data offer and add it later if you want to add the data later or if you don't have an offer you will notice that the save and finish button is not grayed out this means that your listing is complete and can be posted but before you post it make sure to double check all the information first once everything is final you can click the save and finish button to post your listing so that concludes our tutorial on how to create amazon listings variations by color and size thanks for watching for more videos like this don't forget to hit the subscribe button see you soon